All right, everybody. Good morning. Not too early in the morning. It's about nice, roughly. The 6.0 is running good again. In the previous video, how clogged up the filter was. That was very, very pathetic. So anyways, just as a, as a quick video here. got here you can see over there little work system dude I gotta change water nasty so anyways got some cats here. and what you know as soon as I get them two days later what do we get like three inches of rain so this dry lot is now muddy now there's a lot of gravel right here all the way out through there next to the squeeze chute and down through there. And over here, this is shell. And the ground's really hard. As you can see, the mud's not too deep. It's not even over my boot. And that's about as worse as it'll get because this is a very shelly, red shell rock kind of ordeal. Uh, so the mud, this is about as, as bad as it's gonna get. Is what you see right here. So I'm okay with that. Now when I get this moved out of the way, they'll have all that gravel they can stand on, which will help them stay out of the mud, which the mud in here ain't too bad. Um, I will continue to put gravel in here. Um, I've got gravel out to here so far. You can see the gravel really helps. Now this, the gravel's underneath there, but there was a rut right here that I filled on the gravel and the mud's come up through. So anyways, there they are for the moment there, and that's all that's left of a roll of hay. Not too bad. I mean, you can, it's probably a foot deep right there is all they wasted. Thanks to a John Deere roll, it was rolled extremely tight. And most of that there is the outer layer because the hay did sit outside. So anyways, uh, tip of the day for you, when you build a lot, now this is just a temporary lot, but tip of the day is when you build your corners, make them round like this. See how this is, see how that's a corner? Back up here, see how it's rounded? Well, when you're trying to move cattle or work cattle or move them wherever you want to, see if it's a corner like that, they come right up here and stick their nose in it. And it makes them think they can get out. When you bend it like this, the cows come up through here and it just kind of deflects them. You just kind of on around. So that's tip of the day. So thanks for watching. Comment if you'd like. Subscribe if you haven't. Tune in next time for the this. Later.